Hey YouTube fam, today we're just gonna go ahead and skip the formalities and I'm gonna go ahead and talk about how you go ahead and set up the um, two-step authenticator factor on Robinhood if you decide to go ahead and choose it or if you decide to go ahead and stick with the company. Um, and so we're gonna go ahead and get into that right now. Let me go ahead and start screen recording. So you go into the Robinhood app and then you want to go ahead and go to the person icon at the bottom and then you want to go ahead and hit um, settings. Um, you see account information, Robinhood Gold, cash management, notifications and messages and you go to security and you hit uh, device security. My device security is Touch ID, and then you go to two-factor authentication. You go ahead and enable that, and then um, it'll it'll give you the option to go ahead and enable it. And uh, you can hit two different auth authentication modes. The first one is SMS, which um, I wouldn't suggest because with SMS, as Andre J talked about, um, shout out to him. Uh, you can have someone can go ahead and switch your uh, SIM card out and get access to your information and go ahead and hack into your Robinhood account and take out the money. So what you want to go ahead and hit, and hit is app based. And um, while you're hitting app based, you want to go ahead and hit your uh, Play Store or your App Store and go ahead and download the Google Authenticator app. Um, and you want to use Google Authenticator app because it's the only one that we can confirm is uh, actually legit and actually does what it's supposed to. And when you do that, um, it'll give you a, a six digit code um, that you'll need to go ahead and put in within like a minute or 30 seconds or something like that. And once it does that, um, you'll go ahead and get a backup code, which you'll want to go ahead and write down on a piece of paper and put it in a safe spot because you don't want to put it in your notes because if someone gets access to your phone, they can just look in your notes and figure out what your you know backup code is. And once you go ahead and do that, you should be all set and secure. And so that's basically today's video. I know it's not very long, but I thought this would be crucial information for the millions of users that use uh, Robinhood um, who may be deciding to go ahead and stick with the company. Um, so I hope this video was informative and useful to you and I hope that this uh, helps you out and gives you, brings you a peace of mind. With that said, thank you so much. If you'd go ahead and like this video and um, hit that notification bell, maybe subscribe if you'd like. Um, if not, have a blessed day and thank you so much. See you in the next one.